I am an American patriot, and yet I am not celebrating 4th of July this year. And honestly, it breaks my heart. <laughs> I'm not saying that I hate America. Uh, I adore this country. 4th of July is my favorite holiday, guys. And I was a holiday blogger for 10 years. It was my favorite. I still love my country, but it has made me very, very sad lately. And I am one who lives in North Carolina where my freedoms aren't being uh, taken away at this, at this time. But for the other 22 states that are have already changed the laws or are about to change the laws and are limiting women's rights to autonomy over their body, to healthcare rights, uh, this is not good. And I'm not just mad at the Republicans in the Supreme Court, I'm mad at the Democrats too, friends, because they have had 50 years to codify this or fix this and change it so it couldn't be thrown out like this. And quite honestly, I don't even know what they've been doing. What the heck? Anybody with emotional intelligence can tell you that you can have two feelings at the same time. I can be very sad about my country and disappointed in my country and not like <laughs> what they have been doing and still also be grateful for the freedoms that I have had. So if you feel like me and you live in the Charlotte area, I am inviting you to come spend 4th of July with me. I am inviting any woman to come hang out at my farm all day on July 4th. And we are gonna call it Women's Appreciation Day. I got a porter potty, I got a pond, I got cornhole, fire pits, uh, picnic tables. Bring everything you need. Bring a tent, bring, pack your food, uh, bring your bathing suit. Let's lay out, let's just, I'll put out a slip and slide and we will all celebrate women on Monday. Send me a message if you want to come hang out.